Hello everyone, I'm James with Total Sports Newsroom, bringing you the latest in entertainment. In a recent development involving the Cyrus family, Miley Cyrus shared a heartfelt photo of her hugging her mother, Tish Cyrus, amidst the release of controversial audio involving her father, Billy Ray Cyrus. The photo, posted on Miley's Instagram, shows the 31-year-old singer and her 57-year-old mother smiling and embracing at a Gucci event, offering a united front during a turbulent time. Earlier that day, Us Weekly obtained audio recordings of Billy Ray, 62, in a heated argument with his estranged wife, Fire Rose, 36. The recordings, first reported by Daily Mail, reveal Billy Ray berating Fire Rose over being late to a performance. If you would have left it the FK alone, he said angrily. The argument escalated with Billy Ray expressing frustration about not being listened to and making disparaging remarks about his family. In the audio, Billy Ray referred to his children from Tish's previous relationships in a derogatory manner and made comments that seemed to target either Miley or Tish as devils a skank. This inflammatory language has sparked significant backlash and concern. Adding to the controversy, text messages obtained by Us Weekly show Billy Ray reacting strongly to Tish's appearance on the Call Her Daddy podcast. He accused her of being a liar and worse, further inflaming the situation. Fire Rose has accused Billy Ray of extreme verbal, emotional, and psychological abuse, and cited his substance abuse as a factor in his unpredictable behavior. In response to the leaked audio, Billy Ray took to Instagram stories on Wednesday, admitting he was at his wit's end and accusing Fire Rose of trying to take over his career and life. His attorneys stated that more evidence would be presented in court to refute Fire Rose's claims. The Cyrus family remains at the center of this unfolding drama, with Miley and Tish showing solidarity amidst the controversy. That's all for now. Stay tuned for more updates and insights. I'm James, and this is Total Sports Newsroom.